Welcome to Master Mathematics in Minutes. Today's topic is about the area of a parallelogram and rhombus, and we will consider a couple of examples on how to calculate the area of a parallelogram, and we'll consider a couple of examples for the rhombus as well. We'll conclude the topic with a summary, and finally, be kind and subscribe for more videos. So, what is the area of a parallelogram and rhombus? The area of a parallelogram or rhombus is the product of its base and height. We'll consider this visually. So here we have a parallelogram and we have base of B and a height of H. And these two lines are parallel and these two lines are also parallel. And we have a rhombus towards the right. So a rhombus is a special case of a parallelogram where each of the four sides are equal in length. And we have base of B and height of H as well. And so the area is equals A and that is equals to base B multiplied by the height H. In the first example, we're asked to calculate the area of the parallelogram below. So we have base of 8 centimeters and a height of 2 centimeters. And so the area is equal to A, and that is equals 8 multiplied by 2, and that is 16 centimeters squared. In the second example, we're given the area of the parallelogram is 70 centimeters squared. And we're also given the base is 10 centimeters. And we're asked to calculate the height. And so we have area is equals A is equals B times H. And that is equals to 70 from above. And we know that the base is 10. And so we'll substitute B as 10. And we'll copy H and copy 70 down. And so H is 70 divided by 10. And H is 7 centimeters. And so visually, we have a parallelogram of base 10 centimeters from above and a height of 7 centimeters based off what we've just calculated. In the third example, we also calculate the area of the rhombus. So we have a rhombus of base B as 5 centimeters and height of 4 centimeters. And so the area A is equal to 5 multiplied by 4, and that is 20 centimeters squared. In the fourth example, we're asked to calculate the base in centimeters. And we're given the area of the rhombus is 200 centimeters squared. And we're also given the height is 10 centimeters. And so we have area is equals A is equals the base times height. And we'll set that to be 200 from above. And B is what we're trying to solve. And we have H, which is height as 10 centimeters. So we will replace that by 10. And we'll copy the 200 down. And B is equal to 200 divided by 10, and B is 20 centimeters. And so visually, we have a rhombus of base 20 centimeters, base of what we've just calculated, and a height of 10 centimeters, base of what was given in the question. To summarize, the area of a parallelogram of rhombus is a product of its base and height. And we have area is equals A, and that is equals to B for base multiplied by H for height. Thank you very much for watching. This is Master Mathematics in Minutes.